Wow, there sure are a lot of circles in this bowl. What are you doing, Ban? Making sure that we each have the same amount of cereal. Maybe I should count each crispy -o. One for me, one for you. One for me. Or you could weigh the cereal in each of our bowls. Shona, how am I supposed to weigh a crispy -o? I'll show you. I'm going to keep counting. One for you, one for me. Wait, we have just the thing. Aha! Uh -huh. What's that? This is a balance. It compares the weight of what's on this side against what's on that side. And it shows you which is heavier. Like this. Now put your bowl of cereal on the other side. The side that goes down more is the heavier side. That means you have more cereal. I'll fix that. You did it! Your bowl of cereal and my bowl of cereal weigh exactly the same. They're equal. What else can we weigh? I wonder which weighs more, this apple or this banana? Let's find out! The, the apple. apple! What do you think weighs more than this apple? A loaf of bread, maybe? I have something better! I think Ollie is heavier than an apple. Ollie wins! Do you think he's heavier than two apples? Ollie wins again! <laughs> this is fun! What else can we weigh? I wish we could weigh ourselves to see who's heavier. But we're too big for that little thing. We're too big for this balance. A teeter-totter! Just think of it as a giant balance. Let's try it! Here I come! Looks like we know who's heavier. Come on, Clyde, up! Who's heavier now? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, guys. Today's session is called Weight. Let's remember that our performance is called Building a Better Future and our lines of inquiry are Future Vision and Defense. The purpose of the session is to introduce weight as a magnitude. And we have three criteria for the session. First, to recognize weight as a magnitude that can be measured. Second, Indicate which object is lighter or heavier than another. And the third, to follow instructions carefully. Let's start. So, the big question for this session is what is weight? Maybe you have an idea after watching the initial video with the children trying to measure the cereal bowls. Weight is how heavy something is. As you can see with these pictures of different um, animals and people carrying objects. Some things can be really heavy, such as an elephant, a car, or a TV. And others can be really light, such as a feather, a pencil, or a flower. But how do we measure weight? There are different instruments. We can measure weight using balances to compare the weight of different objects like the kids were doing, or we can use scales of different sizes. There are some special words that we are going to use during this term when we talk about weight, such as the same as to indicate that the weight is similar in two objects, equal to, these are synonyms, 
we can say that objects or people are lighter than others, heavier than others, or that they weight more or less than others. Let's practice. In this picture, you can see two animals. The question is, which animal is heavier? And the answer is, the elephant is heavier or the elephant is heavier than the dog. Here is the opposite situation. We want to know which object is lighter, the leaf or the book. We can say that the leaf is lighter or the leaf is lighter than the book. Another example with animals. Which animal is heavier? You can answer that the giraffe is heavier or the giraffe is heavier than the cat. And finally, which object is lighter? We have a tooth cream and a toothbrush. We can say that the toothbrush is lighter or the toothbrush is lighter than the tooth cream. You can practice a bit more with this song. You're going to find the link on the presentation that you can check when you finish the video. What are the instructions for today's session? First, watch the video carefully at least two times. Step two, take some notes according to what you learned from the video. Step three, look around your house and write a list of objects that are lighter and heavier than a smart TV. Keep your list and your notes for next classes where we will talk more about weight. That's all for today, guys. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.